Oz Quickie Playground. This is the place where not just my kids are active, but I am as well. Today we're going to have a fun little outdoor workout here using the playground equipment and also demonstrating some ways to improve your chin-ups. I've been getting a lot of questions from women who would love to build up some strength to be able to do a chin-up on their own and even some guys as well who are struggling to get in a chin-up. So I'm going to show you a fun way, an outdoor way to improve uh, your chin-up strength. But we're going to have a lot of fun in today's workout, so let's get started. Now for guys, if you're um, strong enough already, you can do some chin-ups on your own. Playground equipment comes in really handy, just grabbing the monkey bars here, monkeying around and doing some chin-ups. Okay, so that's one little fun outdoor exercise. Now, if you can't do chin-ups on your own, I just got a long towel here. And one of the things that you can do is just loop it around one of the monkey bars. And what you're going to do is come down on your knees. You're gonna use your legs to help you a little bit. So I've got my, my toes planted on the ground. And when I'm pulling up, if you need help, you just kind of Use your legs a little bit to drive you up. If you want to get a better grip, you just wrap your hands around the towel and you're just pulling yourself up. So you can use your legs a little bit to help you out. If you want a wider grip, you just loop it around two different monkey bars here. And if you want to do like a row, going to come down. Your feet are now in front of you and you're just pulling up. If you want to make it more challenging and you got to swing in front of you like I do, actually you can use both swings here, a little off balance, and you're pulling yourself up. Now, if you don't have kids playground equipment, I'm just gonna go over to the fence here. There's just a little post, a little bit of room sticking up above the post. I'm gonna wrap the towel around it and do an assisted chin up. So there's a little pole there. Same thing as wrapped around the monkey bars. So that's some ways that you can improve your chin-ups. Now let's get to uh, the rest of the fun outdoor workout here. So you've got two swings. These are a little bit off in height, but it doesn't matter. You still get a great workout with them. Doing some push-ups with the swings. And if you need some assisted push-ups, just put your knees on the ground, same thing. This is great because it throws you off balance a little bit. It's not like a stable push-up. With the swings, it can drift a little bit, so really recruiting a few extra um, muscle fibers and nerves in there. Next, you can do a Bulgarian squat. So you have your foot up on the ladder here, and you're just dropping that knee back behind you. and you would switch legs. Next, you can do some dips. I got my kid's little rocket launcher thing here. I'm just putting my hands on the edge of the bench. And this is an unstable thing, so if you're a beginner, I don't recommend the unstable environment like that. But my elbows are staying close together, and my back is staying close to the rocket launcher. I'm just dropping my butt down. You don't want to have your body far away because it's going to put undue stress, unnecessary stress on your shoulders. It could risk injury, so you don't want to do that. Keep your body close to the rocket. If you don't have a rocket launcher like we have there and you want a more secure environment, you just use your ladder here. So I would just put my hands on the ladder, dropping my butt down. Now, you can perform that fun little outdoor workout either in a circuit, just going one exercise to the next, or you could do supersets. So you could do 
go back and forth between the push-ups on the swings and the chin-ups and do three sets of that or and then move on to the Bulgarian squat and the dips and alternate back and forth between those two exercises. Do three sets of those and I mean, that's your fat loss quickie outdoor workout. Your heart rate will be pumping. It's definitely um, working the chest, back and leg muscles are definitely going to help get that heart rate accelerated. If you want to incorporate some cardio into it, you could do some burpees, some jumping jacks, some sprints here in the back air, back and forth. I could chase the kids. <laughs> that's usually what's happening out here. And that's the fun part about this kind of a workout is that usually my kids see me doing it and they want to get involved as well. So it makes it even more fun. So I may be doing some some squats or some dips on here and my daughter might be going across the monkey bars and if I'm doing some sprints she she would be uh, I'd be chasing her back and forth and same with my son but we have a lot of fun and that's what fitness is supposed to be all about it's supposed to be fun exciting you're not supposed to dread it and, and just not be able to stay in working out you want to be excited about your workout our main goal here is happiness we're always striving for happiness so have fun with your workouts. Do things that excite you, something that you're going to stick with. Hope you really enjoyed today's Fat Loss Quickie Workout, our outdoor fun playground. I've been seeing some fun little finches flying around here and butterflies, so pretty cool to be out in the outdoors, getting away from the office every once in a while. I love doing my home office workouts, but when the weather's nice on a day like this, I love to get outside. Have yourself an awesome day. See you next show. <laughs>